Hey everybody, it's Michael at Gotcha Rocks and I am uh, in Kautokeino, uh, Norway. And uh, this is the backdrop back here. And Liz and I are just walking along this trail, which goes for quite a while. And we're just trying to find little pieces of too light or too light, uh, as they say here. And what is the other one? Uh, Fauchsite, uh, F-U-C-H-S-I-T-E, which is a beautiful green stone full of uh, like mica and quartz crystals. So not the greatest to cut evidently, but we're gonna find some and uh, let you know how it turns out when we get back to the States. All right, so we've just found um, this kind of pinkish stone here. So there we go. And uh, I don't think it's too light, but it is kind of like a pink quartz. And so that's kind of interesting. And then there's a couple other little pieces here. Let's see. Here and here. It look like, I don't know, I can't tell if it's granite because it's wet right now. But that, I mean, that could be a little piece of too light, but it could just be granite and quartz <coughs> stuff. So anyway, I'm just going to grab a few of these. Definitely this one. It's kind of unweathered yeah, right there. So if nothing else, I could make a nice little cab out of that and just say, hey, I got it in Norway. All right, so here's some of the uh, fuchsite. site. Uh, this has been completely ground up, but this is on the trail. And it's so prevalent here that they just kind of use it when it gets icy. So they'll just have a bunch of this and throw it over there. If we go over here, you can actually see some of the thulite here, which is this stuff, which is just mush at this point, but um, you can see how green that is. So we'll show you some nice pictures of some really big pieces here in a little bit. So right over here we have a little reindeer farm. How cute are those little guys? So, doing their thing. There's one standing up over there. Alright, here's a cool stone. Uh, they call these, uh, what, wishing stones. And they have that stripe going through. Not the best one because it's broken off, but it would have been cool. So anyway, that's just one that they have here. So here's a really interesting uh, stone that's very rare. This is called a lighter site. Here's the uh, Sami Theater. This is a big uh, Sami community here. So this is their pretty cool theater. We were in it the other day, just kind of checking it out. So, all right, so I just found a little piece of the uh, Fauchite. And if I'm saying that wrong, feel free to correct me in the comments, but I've heard it quite a few different ways. But uh, hey, I can see that really nice green. There we go. And it's got the, uh, the quartz, white quartz on the other side. So, all right, did a little tiny piece. We're gonna leave that here for somebody. Coming up on a construction site here. Bet they'll have some rocks. And right, here's some more green dust from the car site. Follow the green road. Little, little pieces. Yeah. Little tiny pieces. Little tiny pieces. Tiny tinies. Yep. Well, stay tuned. We did find some like two or three hundred pound pieces. So. Yeah. All right. Well, here's the construction site. Um, not a, you know, your regular junk rock, concrete, pillar stone. So, anyway, nothing here so far. Beautiful shot of the, uh, or a beautiful shot of the Alta River here. So, this is, uh, almost downtown Caltecania. So, yeah. Somebody lost their shoes. I don't know how that happens in the winter. Who killed my sister? Was it you? All right. So this one is very similar to that other one I found. So we're going to grab this and um, we'll compare it to the, the big piece of two light that I have. And we'll see how they compare. So, you know, we've got the white quartz crystals and the pink stone so let's just bring it along and see what we get so here's a little piece of uh what i think is some sort of dendritic 
agate. I can't really tell because it's been so weathered. Uh, it's had all this other grit, so it's very sandy right now. But I'm just going to grab it and uh, bring it back and see if it polishes up. Maybe do a hardness test. You look at these houses right here. You see all this like green stone. So there's a couple quarries around here, and so this stuff is just everywhere. So I'll show you some pieces up here. All right, here we are back at the um, homestead where we're staying for a couple weeks here, and this is the fuse site, and you can see that it's got these like really nice uh, green mica parts here and then it's got the like white quartz that runs through it so these pieces are now some of these are better a couple hundred pieces a couple hundred pounds at least I mean if you look at this thing um, and this one I mean that's that's a monster but you know you can find these smaller pieces and we'll show you that in a second and I'll show you around the outside of this as well all right so here are I'll just bring these up to the camera here's a couple of the pieces we found on the road so that's looking more like just kind of a piece of granite or something like that compared to this is actual too light and we were able this is usually found in telemark or in the telemark area and uh, we were able to get this piece uh, from a friend of ours here and uh, so i'm going to cut this up and make them a couple nice or a few nice cabs uh, so that you can really see the difference so this is very abundant as well, but it is a valuable type of stone. And that's the too late. Here's a couple pieces of the fuchsite. And so you can kind of see the variation there. Here you can really see some of the grains. And here you can really see the uh, mica crystals. So, uh, this one's going to turn into an egg for the person who gave it to me, and this is one I found. So we'll see what this turns into. <laughs> 